Hey guys, my name is Hayden Cassidy and I'm an Andes Global Educator. We're here today at my studio in London in the UK. Today I'm going to show you some of my favourite techniques that have helped me to become a successful barber. I hope you enjoy them and let's create together. In this tutorial, we're going to take you through a long haired, textured haircut. We're going to take you through a step by step on how to achieve this look. Begin by combing the hair away from the face. You want to make sure the hair is completely wet so that you can section the hair nice and easy. Start by creating a hot cross bun section in the hair. This will allow you to isolate sections easier. Once you've created your hot cross bun, you can now isolate your recession areas. This will isolate the top of the head. Now we're going to create a triangle towards the back of the head, which will isolate the crown. Once that's complete, you now have your finished sections. You can tie the side bits up if you like, or you can leave them, it's up to you. We're going to start by creating a triangle shape on the back of the head. We're going to isolate two sections at the back of the head, just to keep things nice and clean. We want to create a straight one length cut and texture throughout the haircut. To do this, we're gonna start by creating our baseline. We're gonna remove the desired length by using our Andes Slimline Pro Trimmer. Ensure the comb and the tension is correct and the hair is wet enough to allow you to glide through the hair. Once we've removed the length, we're now going to shaft the hair and point cut. This will give us a lot of texture and movement throughout the base of the hair, so it's not too straight and perfect. We're now going to work on our next layer by continuing to do the same technique. With longer length and men's hair, we always want to create a textured shafted look. We're now going to work on our next section and continue to use the initial guide throughout the haircut to create our blunt look. Notice how I'm using different angles of the trimmer. This will allow me to really create a textured finish. Next, comb the hair behind the ear to the back of the head. Use your guide to continue your one length cut. Repeat the same on the opposite side. We're now going to cut our desired length on the top hair. This is going to give us the direction for our layers. Ensure that the head is in the correct position so the haircut is nice and balanced. Remove the desired length and use this as a guide for the rest of the haircut. The 
ensure the tension is correct and each section is pulled back to that desired length. We're now going to connect our layers into the back of the head. Using that same point, we're going to start to bring the back of the head up to that area. This will allow us to create layers and movement throughout the haircut. Now we're going to use our profile guide to cut horizontally across the head. This will connect the top into the sides and maintain movement and layers towards the hair. Once we've completed that, we're now gonna work along the baseline. Using our Andes Slimline Pro Lithium Trimmer along the baseline will allow us to shaft the edges of the hair, creating a nice textured look. Once we've completed that, we're now going to style the hair in a natural look. I'm using sea salt spray, pre-blow dry, to really work into the hair and give it that natural finish. Using a diffuser, it will allow us to bring the texture out in the haircut. I would always recommend using a diffuser or naturally towel drying the hair when working with men's longer hairstyles. You don't want them looks to be too groomed. You want them to suit the hair and suit the style of your client. I hope you enjoyed this long hair textured haircut. This haircut is perfect for any client who wants to grow their hair out but doesn't want to look too groomed. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed some of the techniques I've shared with you. Enjoy using them in your everyday salon or barbershop and I hope to see you soon.